Hey, what do you gotta say, buddy? I was drawn in before I knew it. His articulate words moved me to the core. This country's got a first-rate economy with a cut-rate government. He's a rare specimen. Our souls resonate on the same frequency. That is exceptional. People can always recognize one another. You'll see one day. Ha ha ha. I'll be going home. I hate you. I, I hate everything about you. Sojiro, I made the top of my class. Oh, I guess you can't judge a book by its cover. Then maybe you didn't need this. Oh, well, take it. Oh, a charm. <laughs> I made it myself. It's got my finest coffee beans in it. I wanted to give this to you before the exams, but, well, you still have more tests. Don't get let up on the finals. All right, the finals. What does that do? Uh, all in all, if I sleep, and it contains boss's finest coffee beans. Oh, huh, don't you love it? All right. Uh, next up, news about sub society. Conduct survey, blah, blah, blah. Close to 90% of respondents say they do not support the Phantom Thieves. <sighs> the whole world's against us now. This could be bad. Yeah, yeah, it could be. All right, so we have, well, don't, I, th here's the strange part. I'm actually free to do stuff, which is very strange for me to say because the original plan okay. was to, um, oh, this is all I have. Oh, mm. run it as is. Uh, we can call Kalakami. Uh, so yeah, I actually have a lot of free time because at this point in the game, the notes that I have you know, I involve maxing out my guts. And since I've maxed out my guts and none of my other stats needed to be made, um, I guess I'm free to do whatever they, I, whatever I, well, what's this dude doing? I, oh, great detective catch. Well, I apprehend this criminal fan of thieves. All right, I catch a coon. Let's get you home. Your family's probably worried about you. <laughs> There's an incident, officer. Which way's your car? Hey, taxi! Jeez, my patrol car is in the taxi. Mm. So yeah, I'm. I'm. Th this is the strange part because I'm free to do what I want to do. So I guess. Oh gosh. Uh, like, I have an idea. I was actually debating what to do. I forgot what I was going for. I was going for everyone's technical damage. Because what we could do is we could try to raise... Our billiards. Let's do that. Let's go to the darts and billiards. Oh, wait, wait, hold up. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I don't, I, I don't do this enough because I don't really care. What's at the jazz club today? I see. Nice cocktail is might teeny. It's good. Bring your boost your stamina. Also oh, boost stamina. What, when is it happening? There's a singer coming in on November seventh. Okay, so that, so today is just raising stamina. Okay, I, I just want, I just want to check. Just want to check. I don't care. Welcome. What do you play? Uh, yeah. Let's play some billiards. Let's want? raise everyone's um, everyone's team affinity. Yeah. I've read the book, right? I should have a cool trick ready to go, right? <laughs> yeah. Everyone's here. Let's let's hang out. Form is really important, huh? If you don't make a clean shot, the ball's gonna curve. That was fun, huh? Even if you don't win, it's just fun to sink the balls into pockets. Glad to see everyone had fun. I gotta say though, wow. thanks to playing billiards, looks like you've gotten better at analyzing situations. Yeah, you can you can say that. Is it knowledge? It's knowledge. That was so much fun. All right, cool. That's not raising our technical Shit. damage, is it? Shit. <laughs> well, we got points to everyone's confidants. That mattered, I guess. Hi. 
It's fine. It's a free day. I can do whatever I want. The festival seems to be a success. There's definitely a lot more people than last year. Well, yeah. This place got famous and all. The Phantom Thieves, Kamoshida, Principal Kobayakawa. On top of that, we got Akechi as a guest. There may be police officers in plain clothes, too. Actually, they probably are here. We better be careful about what we discuss. Acting like normal students is going to be important. What do you normally do at a school festival? Look around at the exhibits and eat stuff? There's no set rules for this kind of thing. Walk around and hang out, like when we went to the beach. Yeah, just enjoy yourself. I think I can do it if I've got everyone with me. You're so laid back. There's a possibility that your name and Ryuji's have come up. A number of the teachers had been questioned before, and even we were interviewed the other day, too. Don't let your guard down too much. It's true that the initial members have been at this for a long time, making it easier to get tracked. All right. Now, now, let's leave it at that. We just need to be mindful about what we're saying, correct? Oh, um... <sighs> you seem to be having quite a lot of fun, Haru. You did mention that you were looking forward to this. I want to go around with everyone, and eat at the refreshment stands. This'll be a great change of pace from all the nasty stuff lately. Shall we head off to the stands, then? Let's do it. All right. This is your first time at our school festival. They're pretty good, from what I've heard. I know a great one. Follow me. This is the place. Made takoyaki? New customers. I'll show you all to your seats. So, it's your classes stand. It's still a refreshment stand, isn't it? It's like a deserted island here. Well, I guess it's good for talking since there aren't any people here. We heard a lot of rumors even on our way here. And it was all bullshit. Here she comes. Act normal. Who cares? There's nothing normal about this anymore. Welcome home. May I take your order? Take my order? W what happened to the maid atmosphere? There are a lot of odd flavors. Stick to a normal one. I bet they... I'm so sorry. We sold our last normal one to the previous customer. The hell? Well then. I'll have the mentai cheese takoyaki. I'm sorry, we're out of cod bro. Then how about the squid? Um, we're currently out catching squid. It'll probably take another five or six hours. That doesn't even sound remotely possible. Ain't this whole menu just a sham? Actually, we spent most of our budget on making the maid costumes look nice. We didn't put too much effort into the octopus. Oh, I can see that! Ryuji, you're making a scene! Then, what would you recommend with what you have now? That would be the Russian takoyaki. We'll have that, please. This will take a little time. Uh, let's forget about the octopus and get back on topic. On that note, hearing Kamoshida being almost treated like a victim makes me want to eat my stress away. I've even heard conjecture that the principal was targeted for reasons like he knew too much. I kept hearing about Goro Akechi's popularity. All thanks to the Phantom Thieves. 
You know, did that Akechi guy agree to show up here because he believes we didn't kill anybody? Or he may simply love large gatherings. Oh, true. He didn't seem like he minded being pampered by the media at all. We plan on stealing intel, but we might fall into another trap. I'm gonna be bummed if that happens. Did Takoyaki done yet? You are so carefree. Does it mean that you have nerves of steel in any situation? Oh no, I'm freaking the fuck out. I just love changing topics whenever I get the chance, cause, you know... I, I, I don't like thinking bad stuff. I sweep bad stuff under... So is that Takoyaki done yet? Still, it doesn't change the fact that we don't know what Akechikun is planning. Thank you for the wait. Ooh, it's fresh made. Lies, I heard a microwave go off. No, 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 Futaba, that was an oven. Well, it's not like I was expecting crispy takoyaki at a school festival or anything. So, what makes this a Russian takoyaki? Could there be jam in it as a secret ingredient? That sounds quite delicious. Well, one of these is special. Uh, one of them's obviously red. That's gotta be the one. Dude, don't tell me the Russian part means... It's like, going for the obvious one is manly. Is that so? Well, I'd prefer the most beautifully shaped one. But all of them are misshapen. Oh, aren't you all going to eat? I think I'll go for the special one. Wait, is she honestly going for it? She has more guts than any of us, I'll tell you that much. Do you want to go for the red one? Eh, I'll take it. I hate my life anyways. Ooh, impressive as always. Oh, everyone's all here. The, the panel isn't until tomorrow, though. I came to check out the venue. I can't make any mistakes, since a lot of people will be present. Someone's eager. But people ended up recognizing me. Everyone bombarded me with questions. That's because you were sloppy. I grew tired of the baseless rumors they kept bringing up. So I escaped to where there weren't any people. I'm going to have one of these. <gasps> the special one! Let's just call this my performance fee. But... It's fine. Hmm. It's quite the... is a bad idea. My throat. This is... Oh, oh, my stomach. It burns. Are you okay? Do you need water? I'm... I'm fine. I just love uh, spicy... spicy stuff. Hey. Does he sound broken to you? Well then, I'll... I'll see you, uh... T -t -t tomorrow <laughs> Wow, he's really trying to hold it together. He's waddling around like some comedian. It's like he wants to get picked up for some commercial or something. But, did he truly come to simply check the venue? This isn't good. I keep suspecting every little thing. I know what you mean. I'm doing the same too. I need to do my best tomorrow. We need to somehow get him to be our source of intel. I'm gonna pull this off no matter what. That Akechi guy. When he got here, didn't he say that everyone's all here? Everyone? You're here just imagining things. 
That is a bit sus, though. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Just, hmm. Maybe it was a bad idea. So, I guess we got through all of it okay? Yes, but the associated mental fatigue was extraordinary. Being cautious takes a lot out of you. Seriously? I think I'm as tired now as I am after midterms. I didn't mind any of that. I just love seeing that detective gulp down the special takoyaki. I had fun as well, since I got to spend time with you all. What would you like to do now, Haru? Walk around a little more? I appreciate the gesture, but I'm satisfied with stopping here. Why don't we go home and rest up? We'll have to deal with Akechi-kun again tomorrow, after all. I have to agree. What will his next move be? Oh? Wait. Uh, Kazuma? Yos yeah, Yusuke is missing. Huh? <sighs> Where'd he wander off to? Always doing whatever he pleases. Think he's still checking out the, all the festival stalls? Let's head back. Well, I'm sure he'll be fine. This is Yusuke we're talking about. Let's head home. I mean, sure, but shouldn't we be slightly concerned? Um. Excuse me. You are Dr. Takto Maruki, correct? Uh, huh? Yes. Oh, um, yes. I. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. I'm a student in the fine arts division at Kosei High. I do apologize for interrupting your day, but ever since Ryuji and On first spoke of you, I've grown quite, uh, quite intrigued. Now I wish to speak with you as well. Re oh, Sakamoto-kun and, and Takamaki-san? Quite. Oh, well, I'm flattered that you've taken an interest in me. You're here about the counseling, right? Indeed. Correct. Now teach me how to unshackle the human heart and glimpse into the end its endless abyss. Hold on. Whoa, 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 hold, hold on there. Uh, how should I put this? Your enthusiasm is appreciated, but I suspect there's a huge misunderstanding about what I do. Uh, I apologize. I simply cannot contain my excitement. Would you still permit me to witness your counseling skills in action? That's not really allowed. Uh-huh. <laughs> Oh, but how about this? Why not try out my counseling yourself instead? Me? Mm-hmm. Of course. There, of course there's no charge. All you have to do is chat with me for a bit. Well then. Very well. You and I shall go head to head. <laughs> I'm not sure what you think happens in counseling, but, uh, there won't be any of that. I see. So you were Madarame's sons. It's in the past. How curious. I never imagined counseling to be like this. Well, uh... Well, I'd say this is less counseling and more about building a rapport. Whenever, when someone come, first comes to see me, they, we always start with, with telling me... <laughs> we always start with them telling me a bit about themselves. Hmm. Hmm. A method of self-reflection that relies on speaking with another person so as to... As to... So we're, uh, as to... Hmm. So as to sort through one's own emotions. That's rather similar to the internal cross-examination I perform when I'm when working on my art. There, there really shouldn't be any cross-examining in a proper counseling session, though. I just do my best to guide patients in a positive direction so they can improve their lives. At the very least, I talk them through their problems so they can make the correct choices for themselves. I see. However, if you're the one leading them to their conclusions, are they truly making the choices from them for themselves? Isn't that just submitting to another person's will? And all honestly, I know all honesty, I'm sure there are some people out there who think that. But life in this world confines people to certain frames of mind sometimes, and without them even realizing it. If I can help lift the weight off their shoulders and free their minds, I believe the results are worth it. Indeed. Thank you. Thank you very much for speaking with me. This has been the most valuable experience. Oh, yes. Oh, before you go, Kitagawa-kun, what would you say is your greatest wish in life at the moment? Would it be success as an artist? I. 
No, that's not it. The only desire I have for my art is for, for it to improve through my own efforts. I see. Then what would you wish for? I would wish for the world to see my mother's painting for the masterpiece that it is, no matter how briefly. And if all possible, I would also wish to meet a wonderful master, one who would take me in and guide my brush with care. Hmm. Ah, I see. All right. At any rate, I must be going now, so please excuse me. I hope we meet again someday. Well, then. Tomorrow's the moment of truth at Ketchy's panel. Oh, my phone's vibrating. Apologies for suddenly disappearing like that. The legend of the lost Dinari has come to an end. Where the hell were you? Did you seriously get lost? I saw a man who resembled Dr. Maruki, so I went to see him. So he was there. Did you go to his counseling? Yes, it was certainly not what I was expecting. Once this is all over, I think I'd like to go for to another session. Try not to cause him any trouble, all right? I'll do my best. Are you all at home? <laughs> I'm at home. Are you still at school, Yusuke? No, I just got back to the dorm. I'm getting ready for bed. Already? Is is that unusual? Tomorrow's a catchy coon's panel, after all. An early night means he'll be able to be, uh, concentrate tomorrow. That's true. We'll need to stay focused tomorrow. We have to stay calm no matter what he says. Right, I'll keep that in mind. It's really up to Makoto to get as much information as we can from Akechi. We'll just make sure we don't miss anything. Yeah. People want to hang out? Oh no, it's fun. Oh right, I forgot about these. Photo time! This is when we were at the food stand. Oh, that's cute. Why does F Futaba has a lot of noodles? Man, even Yakisoba looks high class when Haru was eating it. Please, you're exaggerating. I think this is my first time having yakisoba from a food stand, though. It was more delicious than I imagined. It was! It wasn't that instant stuff, but it's still good! Yeah, don't know why, but food from a stall is always weirdly tasty. Speaking of, where are the pictures of us on? Hmm? You got pics of us too, right? About the one you took- How about the one you took of Kazuma's yaki yakisoba with the big mountain red mountain of ginger? Oh! No, that one- no, that one went straight into the trash. I had dry seaweed all over my teeth. Aw, oh, rip. That would have been nice to see. Alright, that's it for this episode. Get ready for more plot! <laughs> Every episode is plot. This is just big plot. <laughs>